good day guys i'll be teaching you on how to make this flyer design from scratch so just join you with me as we start our design i will be deleting everything you're seeing here and i will start a new design let me go back and come back to my pixel lab again okay this is my pixel lab so first i will delete this text first that's the first thing i will do then first i will change this background you're seeing here to pure white all i need from you is to just pay attention the first thing i will do now i'm going to import the background of worshippers the background of people worshipping so this is the background just crop a little bit take the part you need and leave the part you don't need then what i will do now is to increase the size you see the background is already blended because i worked on the background i blended the background with another app before importing it to this app then the next thing now you enter your imports enter your imports you bring another background again which is this background you drag it you see drag it just drag it a little bit again and the next thing you do now you centralize it you lock it then the next thing the, you the next thing you do now is to reduce the opacity of this second background you imported this is your opacity tap your opacity reduce the opacity to 70. take the opacity to okay leave it at 75 75 is okay the next thing you do now you import another background again i use three background three different background for this flyer three different background for this flyer so the next thing you do you import your background again import your background again then take the part you want to take and leave the part you don't want and this is our third background then you take it to the back are you seeing you take it what you take it to what the back so now you enter your logo i'll be using this shape as a logo i'll be using this shape as a logo let this shape stand for stand as the logo i will change the color so that you can see what i'm doing take it upwards then you position it very well position it was very well so you leave it there then the second thing you will do now is to enter the name of the church enter the name of church enter the name of what the church so you reduce the size i normally work with 35 35 okay come here you come to your paddle you paddle it a little then you also centralize it then you go and choose a perfect font a font that you know that is going to suit the job it's going to fit okay let's use this nervous yeah this nervous is okay then change the color of the font to pure black the next thing you do is to enter your presence enter your presence enter your what your presence and please i'll be dropping these materials i'll be dropping the link in the description of this video so if you need any of this material just go to the description of this video and you will see the link there the link to each of these materials go there and download it and use it and don't forget to subscribe to this video
then the next thing you do now you bring your prayer okay you go to your go to your space spacing space it out a little then you come to your center you centralize it then you bring it downwards then you reduce the size reduce the size to 35 then you centralize lock it then the next thing I, next thing is the team the team is hallelujah worship hallelujah what's hallelujah worship so what you do now you increase the size of the team can i well just take it to 100 then come here you paddle it what you do now you centralize then you go to your font look for a perfect font the font i use for that team is is what around controller that's the font i use around controller then i added a texture you enter your texture tap here it will take you to your gallery then go to your gallery and select any of the background you want to use as a texture of the font okay this is the background i used and what i did was i rotate it then i crop out the part i needed crop out the part i needed and this is it i you can enable you can disenable but i enabled the the what the shape then you can go to your emboss you emboss it then go to your bivet you take it towards take it to one let me do that thing again go to your emboss tap enable then go down to your bivet this is your bivet take it to one so the next thing now you lock it then you duplicate it then enter your words enter your worship enter your worship For the worship, I use another font, which I'll be showing you. So for the worship, I use Sketch Pro. Sketch Pro. For what? For the worship. So what you do now, you reduce the size so that you can observe the law of alignment. Because the reason why some of our job is not that good is because we disobey the law of what alignment it's not like we did not do it right we did it right but the text and the image was not aligned sometimes in some cases so the next thing i did was to enter my team then i do what i do Paddle to what 25. Then I, I choose a perfect font that will fit this job. Okay. So now what I will do next is to increase the size of what my team. This is it. Then I'll change the color to what? I'll change the color to black. Then the next now do now tap on here. Let me show you again. Next now do now is I will tap on here. Tap on here. That this is when you want to merge two. You want to carry two objects without merging it together. Then I will not tap on here. I will not tap on here. I will not centralize it. 
you see i carried all every everything together without merging anyone then the next thing i did i enter my shape i customize my shape work on my shape from here i seen then this is my radius my radius now if you my radius is is to change the edges of the shape so i take my radius to five this is my opacity i'll take my opacity to zero then this is my stroke i will stroke it to two or three so let's work with three i see the next thing you centralize you lock don't forget to lock the second thing you do again duplicates this shape duplicates this shape duplicates this shape then you tap edit tap edit then what now what you do is your radius now you take it to what to zero then your opacity you bring it to 100 are you seeing then you tap your good okay let me just start a new one what you do now enter another shape again another shape again you drop it then you centralize it then what you do now you bring it downwards of this one then you lock it then the what's next thing you do now you import another shape this shape that i'm about to import i worked i worked on it by myself it's my pixel lab so if you want me to show you how i did it just just comment in the just drop a comment in the comment section then i will show you how i achieved this shape this is the shape you reduce the size so that it can blend this one you imported reduce it okay reduce it a little bit the position is very well then change the color change the color to a color that will match with your design so let's just work with this let's just work with this for the sake of tutorial let's work with this so the next thing you do now is you import your image i've already arranged all the image i've arranged everything So this is the image I used. You see? So now what you do now is just increase this, the sizes of the image. Then you bring them downwards. Increase the sizes. Then you bring them what? downwards. So guys, this is... You can just put in your put in your text. Put in your text where you, where you need to put in your text. Then the next thing you do now is enter your shape. drag it the way you want it your radius take it to five then opacity take it to 50. take opacity to 50. you centralize then you come here again you also what you also centralize then you bring it downwards you bring it what downwards a little so that's the space where you put in the names of the minister so guys please kindly subscribe if this is your first time of coming to my channel kindly subscribe to be seeing videos like this and thank you for watching